What's up guys? Dmulo Fitness here. Today I want to talk about just how to stop caring what people think. How to just do your own thing and just silence out the haters. You know? A hater is someone that is mad at themselves because you're taking action and they're too scared to. That's basically what a hater is. Only way to avoid haters is to be nothing, do nothing, stay nothing. So in other words, you cannot avoid having haters. You gotta do your own thing, you know. You gotta put yourself out there and I'm not saying you will never care, but just do your thing because they're just there because they're jealous. You know, they just do that because they're scared to take the action themselves. You know, they don't have the guts to do what you do, so give yourself credit for that. You know, I'm, I'm a black guy, you know. Black guys in this society, sorry, do not have that much advantages. But you think I'll let that stop me from working hard and going after mine? No. And I couldn't even imagine how it would be for a black lady in this area, you know. Racism still exists, but I will not stop myself. I will not make that, you know, be my excuse. You know what I mean? I'll still go out there, work hard, you know, eat healthy, work hard in school, work hard in work, you know? So you guys can do the same. You shouldn't worry about what advantages someone else has and try to compare it to your circumstances because that has nothing to do with you my problem here has nothing to do with you your problems have nothing to do with my problems so the best way to deal with that is just wake up every day think positive and work hard you know so this video is about how to stop caring the best way to stop caring is just work hard work so hard you be so busy you, you you don't have time to worry about what people are thinking that's the answer to the question be so busy you don't have time to worry about what people are thinking you think someone like uh lebron james or kobe Bryant has time to worry about you know one critic no they're too busy working on the game they're too busy getting money you know you should get busy doing your thing you don't stop and worry about uh, a few people saying stuff about you. They're, all, they're always going to be saying stuff about you. They're always going to be saying stuff about you. There's, there's no way to avoid that. You just got to go out and do your thing. You know, it's like in high school, I used to suck at basketball. I remember. And people will let me know about it. Oh, you suck the basketball. You're not gonna make the team next year. Blah 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 blah. But had I listened to them, I wouldn't have. But what did I do that summer? I devoted all my time and effort to going on the basketball court and getting better. Made the team the next year and the year after that. You know, and then I made fun of for being, you know, skinny in uh what was it in uh junior high and what did i do i did push-ups every night before going to bed until i got old enough to start going to the to the ymca the gym then i started working 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 on my diet you know watching lots of videos reading lots of books you know listening to fitness guys asking questions to people that did it before me and here i am here I am. No matter way, no matter what level you reach, people will always try to put you down to bring them to bring you to their level. And you can't allow that. You can't. You can't allow that. You gotta keep working. You gotta keep pushing. You gotta focus on the goal you wanna reach, not the people saying stuff. Because people are always gonna say stuff. People are always going to say stuff, but it's your decision to either listen or to 
use it as motivation to reach your goals. You know? That's basically all I wanted to say today. People are always going to say stuff. People are always going to criticize. People are always going to find ways to put you down. And really, it's a test. It's a test to see what you do, how you react. If you constantly get hurt by the same things, then... I'm sorry to say, man. You're not going to succeed. The only way you're going to succeed is if you put yourself out there and forget about them. You got to get busy. You got to focus on yourself and your goals. You know, people are always going to talk. People are never going to shut up. People that sometimes, even the sometimes it could be your friend saying stuff behind your back, you won't believe. It's up to you, man. Your goals matter. So don't let people shut you down like that. You know, keep, keep pushing. Keep working hard. Keep being consistent. The results will come. The best revenge for a hater is success. The more successful you get, the more haters will get mad and find new ways to put you down. Just use it as motivation. You don't have to, you don't have to, for me, when someone criticizes me, I take it to heart, use it as motivation to get better. You know? That's all this to it, guys. You know, haters are everywhere. Haters, you gotta thank haters, though. You gotta thank haters. They do make, they do push us to be better. Right? So, in that aspect, they're important. So, yeah, guys, that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to like, share, subscribe. I am out. Peace.